Meanwhile, in the land of the Kais, Gohan continued to undergo the ritual to unleash even more of his latent power. Goku and the others kept their eyes glued to Elder Kai's crystal ball as they followed Gotenks' battle with Majin Buu. Uh, no way! They're back to normal now! Hey! Can you pick up the pace, Gramps? I don't know about you, but the kids are running out of power over here. Uh, are you serious, Dad? Yeah, at this rate, they're goners. All right, off you go. I actually finished about five minutes ago. You're finished? Five minutes? Why didn't you tell me sooner? You fool! Sending you off when the situation is dire is much more dramatic. Oh, no. I'd better hurry or I'm not going to make it. Okay, so how am I supposed to become this ultimate warrior? What do you mean? You turn into that super whatever all the time. It's like that. Just fire yourself up and you'll see. It's like turning into a Super Saiyan, huh? Uh, okay. This is incredible. Do you see this, Dad? What? Yeah. It really is incredible. To Earth, before things go so far that they can't be undone. Allow me to send our new hero to his destination. Sorry I can't join you, Gohan. I wish I could, but I gotta stay here. I wish for a lot of things. I wish I could have seen you grow up. Dad! This is probably the last time I'll see you, Gohan. At least until you die. Good luck, son. Show Majin Buu what you can do. I will. I'll take my leave now. We're counting on you. Right. Um, uh, I've got a small request, Kibito. Could I ask for a change of clothes? I'd like an outfit just like my dad's. I want to honor him when I fight. Hmm, yes, I see. Consider it done. Well, let me see. It was the color of the excrement produced by the frogs on Popol, yes? Um... It's orange, actually. This is perfect! Thank you. Thank you very much. I'm going now. We will be praying for your success as we watch from the land of the Kais. Goodbye. Give my regards to the others. Don't worry. <sighs> All right. Time to go. do much, but I'll join in as well. We'll go down fighting, giving it our all. <laughs> What's this energy? Someone's coming! Gohan's triumphant return. Goodness. I made it. Go on! My brother's here! Hooray! He wasn't dead after all! Whoa, that's Gohan? There's something different about his energy. He seems more confident. Maybe that could be why I didn't recognize him. Where's everyone else? They're gone. Majin Buu killed them all. Even Mom? And Dende? Yeah, we're the only ones left. <laughs> they were yummy. I ate every last one of them. They make good chocolate. 
No, he's wrong. It's faint, but I can sense some key. <sighs> Don't tell me you're going to fight me. No, I'm gonna kill you. Oh, 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 oh. Too bad, Majin Buu. I will not. I... I will not let you do this! I will not! I will not! I will not! Oh god, look at that spit. <laughs> Thinking, Gohan. Thanks. Sure. I can't believe he blew himself up. So is Boo dead? No. Then what happened? Did he run away? I can't feel his energy anymore. He has the power to mask his key. He's hiding and waiting for his chance to attack. Uh, I'm not sure about that. But it did seem like he was up to something. If he is alive, he's not going to be for much longer. <laughs> that guy could barely lay a finger on Gohan. I'd say he was about as strong as our Super Gotenks. He was stronger. Oh, yeah? Hmm. Maybe a little bit. That reminds me, Gohan. Where the hell did you get all this power? Whoa, that old man sounds pretty cool. What about the dragon radar? Who has it? Oh, right. I have it with me. But with Dende gone, the dragon balls, they're pretty useless. No, they're not. Dende's still alive. His key's faint, but you can still feel it, right? What? Oh, yeah, you're right. Let's go and meet up with him. I'm picking up a small amount of key from someone else. What? We're close. I can barely feel his key. Huh? Is that a person? Yeah. That... Hey, it's Mr. Satan! You mean he wasn't killed with everyone else? There's no killing that guy, huh? Let's just leave him here. No. I think we better take him with us. I've been watching him from Kami's lookout. He's a good person deep down. In his own clumsy way, he actually tried to save everyone.
Tende, you're alive. So glad to see you. M Mr. Popo, he threw me down here before Majin Buu could kill me. We owe Mr. Popo a lot. Thanks to his quick thinking, we have a chance. Hey, uh, what's wrong with the kid? His face is all green. Kid? What do you mean, kid? He's the guardian of Earth! Huh? The, the guardian? Approximately one hour after the fight with Boo. Huh? huh? It's Majin Boo! Something's not right. What is he up to? Hey, you little runts! Come over here! I want us to finish our fight! Huh? What did he say? Oh, no, you don't, Boo. You're still fighting me. <laughs> First, I want to finish the fight with them. Then you and me can fight. Why? Why do you want to fight them first? What happened to all that talk about you wanting to kill me? What's wrong, Thomas? Are you scared of me? What? We're not scared of you. Let's mess this guy up for good, Trunks. Now you're talking. Wait, something isn't right here. Don't you find all of this kind of strange? Just get that kid's power and that piccolo guy's brains. What the? No. What do you think, Gohan? Looks like my plan was a huge success. You have just witnessed the birth of the ultimate Majin! This can't be good. Oh, you dirty slimy. I can't believe you actually absorbed them. You have only yourself to blame. After all, you made the mistake of surpassing me. I've been planning this from the very first time I felt your power, from far away. I knew what I had to do. As I fought that Super Gotenks brat, I figured out that absorbing him would make me completely untouchable. But that kid's power had a time limit. He told me so himself. I couldn't have him returning to normal on me, so I bided my time. Gotink said it would take another hour to fuse again, so I lied in wait until then. <laughs> so that's what you were up to. <sighs> you know, if you really wanted to obtain the ultimate power, you should have absorbed me. <laughs> you still don't get it, do you? What's the point if I have no one to rival me? Didn't you hear me when we fought before? I am going to kill you. That's my ultimate goal. Huh, I see. So that's your angle. Makes sense. Yeah. 
Damn it! I'm starting to get bored. Time to finish this! What? No way! Oh, he can't beat him. He's not strong enough. Hmm, I certainly did not see this coming. Well then, that settles it. Goku, you're going to go help him. Huh? Uh, but I can't. That's right, Elder Kai. Goku is no longer able to return to the world of the living. I'm fully aware of that. That's why I'm going to offer him my life. He can then make his way to go on. But you're going to give me your life? Are you serious? I can't allow that. If you don't let me, the entire universe is history. Then I'll offer him my life. It's the least I can do to help. That's enough of that. You're still young. Me, on the other hand, I've only got another thousand or so years left. But, Gramps... Farewell, and good luck. <clears throat> Thanks, Gramps. I promise. I'll try not to waste the life you've given me. All right, then get a move on. Hey, now! Don't let my sacrifice be in vain! Right. Okay, I'm out of here. Wait just a second. I forgot something. Take my patara. Wear one on your left ear when you get there. Wait a second. So wearing this will make me stronger? In a sense, yes. If Gohan wears the other on his right ear, you two will combine into one warrior. What? 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 Are you serious? Yes, and the effect is far stronger than that other fusion technique. Those Patara earrings are considered a sacred treasure among the Supreme Kais. Uh, I never knew about that. Hm. You younger generations are truly hopeless. Go on, try it for yourselves. You and Kabito use your own Patara earrings. What? Uh, wow, this power, it's incredible! <laughs> With this power, I can join the fight too! Don't get carried away, you dolt! Neither of you were much on your own, and fusing isn't going to change that. I see. Wow, you weren't kidding, Gramps! That's awesome! Oh yeah, by the way, how long does the fusion last? The Patara don't have a weakness like that. The fusion lasts forever. It's permanent. Huh? Well, as far as I know. <sighs> There's a shock. I'd be fused with Gohan forever? Well, I guess I can live with that. Quit your incessant babbling and get out of here! Do you want Gohan to die? Uh, uh, right. All right, I'm off. I will destroy everyone and everything! Dad, is that you? What are you doing here? Gohan, take this! Huh? Uh, uh, pick it up, hurry! Put it on your right ear! The two of us 
are gonna fuse and take Boo down! What? Fuse? Found it! Uh, what was I supposed to do with it again? Not gonna happen! with Gohan, but it looks like I beat you to it. There's no one left for you to fuse with. Come on, man. Think you're tricky, huh? Absorbing everyone like that? I can't believe this. <laughs> this energy, it's... it's... What's wrong? Giving up already? And it's time for you to die! <laughs> Instant transmission! This is as far as I can go! King Yama was kind enough to return your body, but only so you can be here to fight that monster. You do understand that, right? I'll be fine. Whether I'm dead or alive, it makes no difference to me. I'll do what I can. Vegeta! I knew it was you! K Kakarot? Listen up, Vegeta. I need you to wear this on your right ear. We're gonna fuse! No, we aren't. Why the hell would I do that? Because! This is our only shot at beating Majin Buu! I'd rather be erased from existence than become one with the likes of you! Vegeta, forget your pride just this once! The whole universe is done for if we don't do this! You've got some nerve! You hid a great deal of your power from me when we last fought, didn't you, Kakarot? What is this Super Saiyan 3? You never cease to piss me off, you know that? I will not fuse with a bastard like you! <sighs> I'm sorry, Vegeta. I can't stay in that form very long. I was saving it for when I really needed it. I don't want to hear your excuses! You disrespected me by holding back. I've never been so humiliated. Maybe this will change your mind then. Everyone's been eaten by Boo! Even Bulma and Trunks! Boo's on his way here! Please! You want to save them, right? Uh, give it to me, now! There you are! Vegeta, just a heads up! This fusion's permanent. There's no going back after this. Got it? What did you say? D damn you! Why would you wait until now to tell me that? This is what I'm supposed to do, right? Yep. Thanks, Vegeta. What just happened? Unite against Majin Buu. Since I'm the fusion of Vegeta and Kakarot, I guess that makes me Vegeta. And this is Super Vegito! Ooh. 
Impressive! Come at me! How dare you taunt me! I wish you'd take this seriously! <laughs> Was that you actually trying? Too easy, Take this seriously. <laughs> All right, I'm starting to get bored, so let's go ahead and end this. I'll give you until the count of ten. Say your prayers if you've got any. One, two, three, four. <laughs> What are you doing? Now's your chance! Come on! You've only got one move left when you're in this kind of position. At this rate, my only option is to absorb him. But how? <gasps> Wait. That's it! I can use the part of me that he cut off earlier! Seven! Eight! So he finally figured it out. It's about time. This is the whole reason I cut off that ridiculous tail thing on his head. Very good. He's not paying attention. Nine! 
All right. Time to see if this is going to work. Ten. Now, Maria! I, I did it! I did it! <laughs> <laughs> this can't be happening. He was absorbed. It's over now. No, it might not be. Huh? Doesn't something seem a little odd to you? When he absorbed someone before, not only did his power increase, but his appearance changed. And now, something's different. He hasn't changed at all. What does this mean? It's possible Vegeta was absorbed by Majin Buu on purpose. Well, isn't he a crafty one? To commemorate my newfound dominance, I'll destroy this planet! Uh, look, something's happening! I knew it! I knew it! He went into Boo to find a way to save his friends! What? This can't be happening! There he is! What are you doing? He, he's returning to his previous forms. What? What in the world? We did it! Everyone's back to normal! We need to hide them. Boo still hasn't noticed us yet. <sighs> All right, I'm heading back to where Boo is. Right. Something's happening to Boo. Uh, wait a sec, Vegeta. Is it just me, or is his energy increasing? Reverting back? Reverting back? What do you mean? The Majin Buu that Bibidi created was evil incarnate. Something even he himself couldn't control. It wasn't until the mild-mannered Grand Supreme Kai was absorbed that Bibidi could finally control him. So, what you're saying is, this little Buu now... is... Even more of a handful than what we've been dealing with? Yes. 
Absorbing others had a dampening effect on him, but now, now his evil is unrestrained. He's lost all self-control and is again pure evil. <laughs> what? What is that? What's he doing? Whoa, unbelievable! That was close. He tried to blow the whole planet to pieces. Dang that little bastard! Hey, Boo! Go ahead and destroy the planet if you want! But you'll have to go through us first! There's no way we can knock that thing back! The others! Vegeta, over here! I'm gonna get us all out of here! Well done! You made it! Yeah, we did. But Gohan and the others... and Earth... K Kakarot! What the hell have you done? Why did you bring these fools instead? <laughs> uh, oh, well, what about Earth? It's gone, I'm afraid. Nothing but space debris now. Uh, uh, Earth... G gone? <laughs> what are you talking about? We're standing on it! Wait! <laughs> yeah! I know what's going on! This is all a dream! <laughs> yeah, it's just a dream! Damn it, Kakarot! Gohan and the others are all dead because you decided to save this dumbass instead! And now Earth and everyone on it can't be brought back! The Dragon Balls! The only safety net we had are gone. What? Dragon Balls? Why in the world were there Dragon Balls on Earth? Those are forbidden, powerful objects entrusted to only the Namekians. No one else should possess them. Th that's right. If we head to New Namek, the new Grand Elder should be able to give us access to the new Dragon Balls there. We can't do it! We can bring back Earth and all those killed by Boo! With planet Namek back, I should be able to teleport between here and other planets with no problem. All right! Now we're talking! <gasps> Take a look! Majin Boo's returning to his original shape! Ah! Here! Give your Patara to Goku and Vegeta. They should be able to beat him if they fuse again. Uh, uh, right. Nah, we don't need those. Huh? huh? Yeah. That type of fusion technique really isn't for us. I want to fight him on my own anyway. Besides, he's not relying on anyone else's power anymore. That's what I like to hear, Kakarot. You're finally talking like a Saiyan. Huh? <gasps> instant transmission before and copied it. Well, whatever. That saves us some trouble. We'll just end this here, then. Get out of here. Find some faraway planet and take everyone with you. Uh, okay. <laughs> right, then. I guess we don't have much of a choice. Pay no mind to this world of ours. Go all out and show that monster what for. Good luck. Uh, oh, no. I forgot to bring that Satan fellow with us. Forget about him for now. All right. 
Who's going first? Let's find out. Rock, Rock paper, paper, scissors! scissors. Yes, I win! Woohoo! <laughs> At least I'll finally be able to see this Super Saiyan 3 of yours. Yeah! Let's do this, Boo! Hmm? Hey! He's sleeping! Are you little? Are you messing with me?
You really are something else. I think I finally figured it out. I think I know why a genius like me can't keep up with you. I thought it was because you had people you wanted to protect. It was as if having a strong desire to save others gave you some mysterious power. And maybe it does in some way. I too have those I care about now. But you are always different. You don't fight to win. You fight to continue pushing yourself past your own limits. That's why you never took the lives of your opponents. You... You even had the opportunity to kill me. But you didn't. You didn't. Damn you, Kakarot. I can't believe a battle-loving, kind-hearted saiyan like you even exists. You're in trouble now, Boo. Here comes my full power Kamehameha! <laughs> Only you can do this. You are number one. Give me a break already. This guy never gets tired, does he? Kakarot, forget about me and just finish him off. Yeah, I'm trying, but I can't. I'm gonna need another minute to charge up my energy if I'm gonna beat him. One minute, huh? I'll hold him off for one minute. You hurry up and charge your power. I'm gonna need that whole minute, you know. Just hurry up and do it! Yeah, I got it. Supersized Spirit Bomb. Are you sure, though? You're already dead. You do know what happens when a dead person dies again, don't you? They disappear from this world and other world. You cease to exist. Don't die on me, Vegeta. <laughs> Mind your own business. All right, let's go.
damn it! I still don't have enough energy! I need more to beat Boo! Boo! I can no longer stand idly by and let this continue! The great Mr. Satan, world's martial arts champion, will put you in your place! Yeah, that's the stuff. It's a shame this isn't real, but man, I nailed it. <laughs> I know it's a dream, but it sure doesn't feel like one. and Boo developed a strong friendship with Mr. Satan. That Boo must have objected to harming Mr. Satan and prevented the attack. Well, that explains why he spit him out then. But to be honest, losing that Satan fellow in this fight wouldn't really change things. Indeed. Super Saiyan 3 really drains all your strength when you're alive. It looks like we're completely screwed. There's nothing else I can do here. Supreme Kai's, Dende, you can see what's going on here, can't you? Can you hear me? If you can, then answer me already. What's that now? Oh, yes, we can hear you. Good. I need you to go to the new planet Namek immediately and gather the Dragon Balls. Uh, oh, but, but why do you... We're just stammering and just do it. We don't have much time. Okay. <laughs> Vegeta, what are you up to? It's a little early for us to use the Dragon Balls. Kakarot, how many times have you saved Earth and its people? Uh, why are you asking me that? Quite a few times, I guess. I think it's about time the people of Earth save themselves for once. We've been waiting for you, Dende. Huh? Oh my, you grace us with your presence, Supreme Kai. Everyone! We are fully aware of the situation. Come, let us hurry. Thank you! Vegeta, we've collected all seven of the Dragon Balls, just like you asked. Good. Now hurry up and summon the Namekian Dragon. I've got two wishes for you to make. First, ask to have the Earth return to the way it was. Then, ask to bring back everybody that's died since the day of the World Tournament, excluding, of course, anyone that's evil. Those are the two wishes. 
Should I make the wishes now? Uh, what about the third wish? The third wish doesn't matter. You've got to hurry. Vegeta, about that second wish. It'd probably be easier to just bring back everyone killed by Boo, don't you think? If we ask for that, Babidi and Dabura will be brought back too. Plus, all the people I killed at the World Tournament Arena wouldn't be brought back. Huh? Oh, oh yeah. Man, you really thought this through. Uh, we have a problem. I, I just remembered that Barunga can only bring back one person from the dead at a time. <laughs> that is no longer a concern. After the incident with Frieza, I took the liberty of powering up Purunga's whiskratting abilities. Really? So we could bring back as many people as we want? N never mind, everything's okay! Good. Now, make the wishes! Kakarapato po Purunga pupirito paro! State your wishes. I shall grant any three wishes that you desire. Takrapto, Paprunga, Paprito Paro! A faraway planet called Earth was recently destroyed. Please bring it back! Okay, consider it done. Your first wish has been granted. Uh, yeah! Now then, state your second wish. Uh, um, how should I phrase this? Pipotara Sariman Popo Toterapo! Um, please bring back all those killed after the wizard Bobbity arrived on Earth. Oh, except anyone evil. Understood. However, it will take some time. That is a lot of people to revive. Right. What? What's wrong, Dende? Have you made the wishes yet? Hey now, quit your yammering, would you? This Parunga fellow is doing what he can. <gasps> Thank you for your patience. Your second wish has been granted. Vegeta, we did it! Everyone should be back now! Look! Your halo's gone, Vegeta! You're alive now! <laughs> That's great! I guess that means you're not a bad guy, after all. <laughs> what, what the? Wh wait a sec. W wasn't I killed by Boo? Uh, huh? What's going on? Huh? Oh, I think I get it now. You're thinking of having Gohan and Gotenks join us in the fight! No. You're going to prepare that attack of yours. The Spirit Bomb. A Spirit Bomb? Really? You're kidding me, right? Who's totally not gonna let me gather energy little by little from people on Earth? Didn't I tell you that the people of Earth need to save themselves for once? It's not going to be little by little. They're going to give every ounce of energy they've got. Hey, Supreme Kai, listen up! Get me in touch with the people of Earth right away! Leave that to me.
That's my specialty. Wh who's that? I know that voice. It's King Kai. Bingo! You know, Vegeta, I'm quite touched you thought of my technique. <laughs> now then, speak! Not just the Earth, but the entire universe is listening. Good, thanks. People of Earth, listen here! I'm communicating with you from a faraway place. Every one of you was killed by Majin Buu, but we used a strange power to bring you all back to life. Everything should be back to the way it was before. And no, this is not some kind of dream you're having. As I speak, right at this very second, there's a warrior here fighting Majin Buu on your behalf. But the truth of the matter is, he's run out of energy and can't fight anymore. That's why we need your help. Raise your hands into the air. We're going to use your energy to defeat Majin Buu. You'll feel tired afterward, but no more tired than after a good workout. Now, raise your hands! All right, Kakarot, begin. You bet. Everyone, lend me as much of your energy as you can. Please! He's forming a spirit bomb. You got it, Dad! Huh. That didn't sound like Vegeta in the slightest. You heard the man! Hands up! Hands up! Huh? Whoa! Here it is! This thing's huge! I can feel energy from Gohan and the others! It's still not enough. Why? Watch out, everyone! Sounds like your energy could really be drained! That sounds painful! It's gotta be a trap! Yeah, I'm not gonna listen to some mysterious voice in the sky. I bet it's that poverty guy trying to trick us again! Damn those bastards! Not a single one of them are listening to a word I said! Uh, hey, uh, wh where are these voices coming from? Uh, uh. Damn, things are looking grim. The fat one's hanging on by only a thread. What are you doing? Cut it out! Stop it right now! Damn it! He spotted it! Kakarot! I'm going to try and buy us some more time! You try and convince the imbeciles of Earth to give you more energy! Ha! <laughs> 
father. This voice. Right. I finally know who this voice belongs to. It belongs to Goku. He and the others are fighting Majin Buu. Hurry, Upa! Raise your hands to the heavens! I get it. So that's who it is. Hmm. It's been a while since I've heard that voice. It's Goku. It's Goku, Sudo. Right! I knew it was him! <sighs> it's no good! I've only received a tiny bit more! What's going on? Why aren't people lending me their energy? <laughs> Everyone! Hurry up! I thought you guys cared about Earth! How about the universe? Come on, you morons! What? Did he call us morons? Wow, he's got some nerve, doesn't he? You know what? Just ignore him. I bet all of this is just a lie. That Majin Buu probably isn't real either. Yeah, we're all probably just being tricked by some hypnotist. That, that's enough! All of you! Why the hell won't you cooperate? Do you intend to ignore a request from the great Mr. Satan as well? What? M Mr. Satan? Huh? What's he doing there? It's really him! It's Mr. Satan! W wait! So it's Mr. Satan who's fighting Majin Buu right now? Yeah, that's right! I am going to pulverize Majin Buu, but I need everyone's help to do it! Uh, uh, sorry, uh, I figured they wouldn't believe me unless I said I was fighting him. The, the important thing is, is that uh, Boo's defeated, uh, right? Dad. Go, Dad, go! <laughs> Is it done yet? What's taking so long? Come on, Vegeta! Hang in there! <laughs> it's, it's no good! Oh, <laughs> 
anyone has attacked before. Finally over. Jeez, it's about damn time. <laughs> what the hell is he smiling about? He never ceases to piss me off.
Did you do it? You, you did it, right? <laughs> People of Earth, this is the World Martial Arts Champion, Mr. Satan! Thanks to your efforts, the terrifying Majin Buu has finally been defeated! You can rest easy now! His reign of terror has come to an end! Vegeta first. He's in a lot worse shape than me. Oh, right! With that weird power of yours? Don't be ridiculous, you moron! Get out of the way! I'm going to finish him off! Oh, stop! No! <laughs> Don't kill him! He's hes not a bad guy! I swear! Look! <laughs> Please! I I'm begging you! I promise! I promise I'll keep an eye on him! Keep an eye on him? Don't make me laugh! Look at a powerless fool like you do! Go ahead and heal Boo, Dende. Wh what? Are you out of your mind? Come on, Vegeta. It'll be fine. If it weren't for these two here, all of us would be dead. Isn't that right? <laughs> fine. Do whatever you want. I don't give a damn. Oh. Well, thank you. Well, thank you so much. All right. Once Boo's healed, let's head back to Earth. I'm dying for a bite to eat and a good long nap. And so Goku and the others finally return to Earth. It was a long overdue reunion with friends and family. With one less than welcome addition, for being away for so long, everybody. That old Supreme Kai gave his life to me so I could come back. So, so you mean we can finally be a family again? All four of us? You, me, Gohan, and Gotan? Yep, let's head back to Mount Pauzu. I've really been craving your cooking, Chi-Chi. Uh -huh. <laughs> In this world, there exist seven mystical wish-granting orbs known as the Dragon Balls. Goku and his friends' adventures surrounding these magical orbs 
are far, far from over. Although there are many more surprises and hardships that lie in store for them, they'll take each one head on. Don't worry, the Earth will always be safe as long as Goku and his friends are around. Alright, so that's the end of Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Finally done with this game after, what, 30 plus hours now? Must have been. So I thought this was a really good game. This was my first time seeing the whole Dragon Ball Z story unfold from start to finish. Some people may think it's not the best way to watch it for the first time, but I'm definitely going to go back and watch the actual series from start to finish now, because I want to see it the way it's supposed to be seen. What I liked is seeing all the iconic moments from the anime into this, you know, into the cutscenes, and it looked a lot more crispier. And it just, it just looks so much better. The fighting was really good. I like the RPG elements too. Even though the elements could have been a little tweaked, I don't know, I just felt like it was off a little. Especially the leveling up system. It's like, it's easier to level up playing story missions because it gives you an absurdly amount of XP compared to like the side quests and such. And yeah, that's all I need to say. If I would put this game on a scale to rate it, um, out of 10, I would say it's an 8. It's definitely an 8. I liked it a lot. It was a really fun game and I enjoyed it a lot even though I'm not the biggest Dragon Ball Z fan. I don't think I've done in any other game that long. Alright, so since that's going to be it, I'll see you in the next one. Hey there guys, welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I just wanted to make a little short video after finishing the story mode because apparently there is a secret boss to do in the post game and uh, I wanted to level myself up a little bit before facing the boss so as you can see I'm level 100 uh, that's not the cap I don't know what the cap is but apparently you can go over 100 I'm not sure what level you're supposed to be in order to fight the boss or bosses but I thought that level 100 was uh, good enough. So the should be over here. It pops up after you fight a bunch of the villainous enemies. I've been waiting for you. It looks like you've improved. It's finally time. The final stages of the experiment can commence.
All right, there's one down. Now just for go tanks. Now to finish it off with the infinite Kamehameha. job all of the energy generated from your fights has contributed greatly to Mira's glorious revival everything is in order for the revival let us go now Mira I will end all of you These energy levels are just as I predicted. No, perhaps far greater. If Mira can absorb all of the energy you produce, he'll become the ultimate warrior. And the demon realm will finally be restored to its former glory. I doubt that you can best my masterpiece now that he is resurrected and more powerful than ever. I am the ultimate being. Prepare yourselves. Let us see how you perform, shall we? Oh, that's really nice of him. He hasn't started attacking until I start moving. I really like doing these clashes. It looks super cool.
Well, this fight's almost over, so let's try to finish it. Clearly not. Simply not yet complete, that's all. You'll need even more energy to reach your full potential. More. I must absorb more energy. I have an idea. We'll move to another timeline. We should be able to procure more energy there. We've done all we can do here. But that doesn't mean the fun has to end. I'll leave you with some of my creations. They should provide enough entertainment for you. Until we meet again. 